my people. Well, I don't do the news. It's not newsing at all this morning. The news we wake up to see. It's not bright. At all. The news not the okay. My people. Anything. When anybody they do for this life. Make him know. Say there is God in heaven. Watching us. Everything you do. In this life. Have it. In your back of your mind. Say God day. They watch over. All of us. The reason why I talk um, The time when Una Ato with you do a question that they drag me, that they do everything to this woman. They don't remember, say, a day like this will come. No, they did not. The time when they question, they break somebody's marriage. She don't know, say, that woman, when she they break her marriage, can turn her back against her and do something like this. She don't know, say, there is a law. I don't think so. They don't know. If she know, she not go do what she do. And this one served as an example for those husband snatchers out there. Yes. Those other husband snatchers out there. This one served as a lesson to Una. Because when I say snatch people was banned. You guys are very good in snatching husbands. Now when I don't know say who my way did for husband has. When he marry, he and his husband sit there together, legally. You could break a marriage. I know. Say when I don't know, say it can be sued. I know that you guys don't know. You don't know, say if you go kiri kiri for it. You don't know so that if he sue you hundred million for breaking up the marriage, you did not know. I know. My people, while are they? Big problem there for grand. Did you work with They don't find yourself in a big mess. When it be say I'm not sure if it come out in a hurry. Mm -mm. They not feel come out so fast. And the time where 
Odogu, they do this thing as well. I'm not sure seeing think I'm. He not think I might not go. He might not go with him, me. Go feed do. The way it look me. The way it look me. On that. Estimate that woman. Yes. He underestimate that woman. Because as he married me, she did respect him. He did give him everything we want. She did do everything for him. He not call let her know. What he made they capable of doing. You see him? You know, no. What did the man they capable of doing? Come forget. No realize. But now, today, he knows, say, hey, which kind of trouble I don't put myself? Which kind of trouble I don't learn myself? So, me can go this far. Yes. I tell you, I said this is how they jump around. So, it's one touch. Just one signature. You don't see yourself for kiri kiri. Only one signature. You don't learn to see yourself for kiri kiri. You are gone. But when I tell you, you don't believe me. But today, see where we did. See where we did today. One petition. Only one confession. We go enter inside. My people, they in a big trouble today as we speak. They're there for big trouble. As me and you, they talk right now. Yo, yo, yo. Would you do a question? They're there for big trouble. They self even they confused. They don't even know what to do right now. Because they not themselves not believe what they happen to them right now. They don't expect what they see. They don't know if it will be like this. My people, Wala, Wala don't finally day. This morning, me, a doche, legal teams, they release letter on their head. I will not. They're telling a joke. That is not well done. 
So I was looking out for men. People wicked though. People wicked. You need to come and see the proofs and the evidence with this legal team tie and wrap down. For you, you, you. And you do a question. You need to come and see. Nothing these people not try to do this woman. Everything. They don't finally call me this morning and you, you and the queen who received the letter. Yes. They received the letter. They get petition against them. Yo, yo, yo. Did you wake up Our beautiful female legal team. All their proof and evidence. Everything we don't do against them. People came out. My people. People came out to testify. 150 people. Now he come out. To come and talk. What do you, you, you and today, Queen, so don't do? Uh, I want us to discuss something. But first, I want to tell a story. Yeah, it's related to what I want us to discuss. So, I hope you enjoy it. Okay, so, it's about a lady. She's married with three kids. And then the husband is also very comfortable. Not like so rich, but comfortable. And he opened up two shops for her in the market where she sells anything like whatever she wants we find out so that so she really to very well the business was really now really may she send this message to but she's the kind of person that doesn't ever want to spend in the house so whenever the husband travels and she buys something she will list it down once the man gets home blah. she's dropping the bill and the man is paying now now may they talk to so not a shame even if it's bread she I made it, it down, the husband me. pays for it. So this has been their style. And for some reason, it works for them, you know? Everybody was okay. So one Christmas, they were traveling home, and they needed a bus to, you know, carry things for them to the village. The woman chatted the bus. Of course, the, the husband paid, and, you know, that's the normal way of things. The husband paid for the bus, and... They went home for Christmas, had their fun, and came back January, and business continued as usual. So, one faithful evening, the husband got a call to come to the police station that the wife is involved in uh, arm robbery. That the wife now, I may should they talk to me that they listen to this woman. <laughs> the man was like, uh, are you talk, guys talk okay? Story. There must be a mistake. Now, kiri kiri you they go. Now you. The man was like, are you guys okay? There must be a mistake somewhere. So, you know, so much pride and being so sure that it couldn't have been the wife. He went to the station and met with the DPO. He was now inquiring what happened, why you guys are arresting my wife, what happened. So, <clears throat> they told him that the wife is a criminal. And that they caught uh, her boys with the wife's boss. That the wife owns a boss, and you know, they now caught her people 
Because what is she the duo? Now they say me the duo. Make could have a list. Like you guys are crazy. Make could have a list. Doesn't own any bus. As far as I'm concerned, my wife has two shops that I opened for her, and it's not even doing so well because she can't spend anything in the house. So what are you guys saying? He told him, okay, go talk to your wife. And at this point, he was like, okay. That police station that you go up. Lo and behold. Now, nah, last story she will tell us. That police station that she go that police station. I was very confused. Like, wait. You own a bus. You have a bus. That is yours. The one was like, yes, I do. She don't they confess for police station phone. She they confess. She has two buses. Two. Now she only confessed. And the husband doesn't know about it. So when they caught, it happened that they caught the driver, the wife's driver was carrying some people that he didn't know were criminals and they had guns. So when they were arrested, of course, they took both him and the boss. So the driver told them that the boss is not his, that he's just a driver. So that's when he had to call the owner of the bus, which is the woman. And when she got there, they told her, where is your, are you married? Yes, so where is your husband? And that's how they brought the husband in. They tell us your so life the man story. was now shocked that the wife owns two buses. And he now asked her, so the bus you used to carry stuff home last Christmas, was that yours? She said yes, and you took the money. You took money from me for using your bus to carry our stuff to the village. Now made a total when I see one. So you can't pay for detergent in the house, but you have enough money to buy two buses and also hide it from me, your husband. She was like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's the devil. I, I, I just, you know, like, I wanted to make you proud when the business would be so big, then I'll tell you, you know, she kept on lying and apologizing. The man just turned around and walked away. He went home, he never went back to the station. You know, a lot of people were calling him, begging him, people from the woman's side, even from his own side, everybody, friends. Begging him that he can't just abandon the wife there. Make I explain for now. Did you ever soon life for this video? Now me, now she did talk say this thing happened to. She go go kiri kiri. Make I go I go play. Make I listen finish. Now me, she won't tell us the way Odogu they run away from us. What did make Odogu run away? This is the full confession. Where she they claim say what did that this and what did me do? Kiri kiri. Now I go land on herself. Make I listen to them. Bail her until the case is resolved and all that. So, after so much pleading, because I mean, nobody would do that because the husband is still there. So, he bailed her out of the station, and that was how the marriage ended. Because he said that, you know, he can't marry somebody that he can't trust. And if the wife can hide two whole bosses from him and collect money from him from on everything he buy in the house, that's that's not marriage. That's not marriage. So the man was automatically done. So he told them his people to go collect the bride price and file for divorce. And that's how the marriage ended. At least that's what we heard. Because my my mother told us the story when I think I was still in secondary school. So now, the reason why I told this story is I know a lot of women are like this. Honesty is the beginning of every relationship. It's the foundation of every relationship. Honesty. I want to talk about honesty. It's very difficult to do when you have a husband that doesn't tell you anything about his money or wealth or whatever. It's difficult, but... To a very large extent, you have to try to be open to your spouse, whether in marriage, whether in relationship. It's very, very important. It's so important because you could fall into a very big trouble and nobody would know how to help you. 
you see some people this applies to not just the women but to the man and the woman <clears throat> so many men today they have a lot of money in different bank accounts their wives their girlfriends or maybe their partner don't know anything about it you see people having millions millions building <clears throat> excuse me building now now hear what she talk she said na mama na tell her the story as a man, they leave his wife because his wife they lie. His wife has so many business. He has car. He the thief. He they do this. I don't tell your husband. Your husband can't find out. The man he has carry a load. Leave all this lie. We don't talk. He get where he go talk. He call call me. Name. Now that the legal team. Cause said okay. You were referring to our clients. If I play a fool. Hotels that their significant other do not know anything about. And then when the person dies, automatically that belongs to the bank. If you're lucky enough to marry somebody that is very open to you with everything he or she has, please, you have to reciprocate. Now, I made it talk to you. Enough to be with somebody now, I made it talk to that you. Once the person is having money, no matter how big, no matter how small, you're the first to know. Please. Try as much as you can to receive. Don't be that wife that will have money and be hiding from the husband. Don't, Don't be, be the that wife husband that will have money. He just they talk to me. He just they talk story where where I don't know why Anna she they lie. Oh now now do good tell her say this is the reason why she left the house. I will play the full video later. I will play the full video later from the beginning to the ending. Where she called a confess, waiting to make Odogu leave Queen. That is exactly what she's doing here. Please share this video and leave your own comment for the comment station. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Thank you and God bless everybody.